Greetings YouTube. In front of you, you see something that I think is going to be a dream of mine for quite some time. I got asked a few times, Prof, why did you go for the quote-unquote easy completion path of the Abyss before completing Act 6? There are several people I trust, great players, not just in my alliance, but other YouTubers, you know, friends that have done both. And they said, Prof, with your roster... Uh, I really do think like you would uh, enjoy it more and it would be overall easier for you than to complete Act 6. And that's a completion, not an exploration. Big difference. Completion is just completing one path of each chapter until the act is done. But of course, exploration is all the paths of all the chapters. And that is, to put it bluntly, a whole new version of Hell and some things put the FU in fun, that is one of them. But this is the prize that you don't even get for fully exploring the Abyss. A six-star Nexus hero crystal. And a Nexus crystal in general does give you control over a champion, but that doesn't mean you're going to get a god tier champion or even an average champion. And all this is to say, there's a summoner that knew I was having a terrible weekend. And he wanted me to put it into perspective. Because this summoner spent a lot of money, a lot of units, and a whole lot of time and frustration to 100% Act 6 recently. He knew that his dream was to open his own version of the 6-star Nexus Hero Crystal. And there are, of course, always so many champions you think about in the 6-star Crystal. From Domino to, uh, gosh, Aegon, Captain Marvel, Nick Fury... Ghost, Corvus, you know, the list goes on and on. You're hoping at least one of those pops up. So, yes, I am doing my best to troubleshoot my own technology and internet issues, and it's never been worse, and that is frustrating, especially when I just want to hang out with my community friends and relax. I have a very stressful teaching job, and so streaming and recording videos and hanging out with you all being what I affectionately most of the time like to refer to as the Joe Rogan of the MCSC community. That's what I do for fun. But, um, yeah, when things aren't going well, it does just add to the anxiety and the stress. So, to put it in the perspective, he said, Prof, let me send you what my six-star Nexus Hero Crystal is. If you are listening to this, if you're not fast-forwarded, I mean, it's only going to be like a five-minute video, right? I mean, it's not going to go anywhere close to ten minutes. Uh, can we type an F in chat or condolences or something for this summoner? Because what I'm about to show you is a nightmare for anybody that does the work, the time, and the effort for a 100% Act 6 exploration. You ready for this? Let's, uh, let's go to the photo. Whew! Rosebud X. The X marks the spot for anger. Six star Cyclops. Kabam Mike would love that. Deadpool X-Force, Dooley Ray is all too familiar with that. And then Venom Pool, who is not the Venom that you want to pull, quite literally, in the Six Star Nexus. The amount of time and effort and money that this image represents, that this screen represents, is really incalculable for me to imagine, and I'm sure that Summoner um, probably doesn't want to calculate that either. And yet here we have it. All things considered, the worst six-star Nexus crystal I have ever seen. Normally, you get two out of three of these, and then you'll at least get something in the middle tier, like, a, I don't know, like a Doc Ock or a Nebula, right? Even somebody like a Hela or a Vegan Thor. Maybe you're thinking about uh, somebody like a Ronin, who is one of my favorite six-stars, Red Hulk, you know? I'm not saying you're going to get a Corvus, but to get th these three six-stars, it's just going to make you think to yourself... What did I do to deserve this, Kabam? Do you want me to quit the game? Do you want me to play something else? Do you want to spend my money in some other way? Because this is the kind of thing that I wish you could just get a re-roll. I get that most of the time that's not appropriate for crystals. But when you open the only six-star nexus you've ever opened and this happens, you deserve a mulligan, as they say in golf. You deserve a redo. But because that is not the case, because this is... As good as he's going to do it. I, mean, I don't even know who he chose, to be honest. I just have to say that uh, his goal was achieved. I do feel better about my weekend now. But can we get some condolences to this guy? Because he deserves it. And quite frankly, 
It's the worst crystal opening I've ever seen.